Before we start, look at this super cool computer beautifier. Make your computer stand out by animating things. This not just works offline, but its online mode works whenever you search and browse things online. This comes with a beautiful animated search engine. This search engine is made to make your searches smoother and attractive, unlike other search engines. When it comes to a browsing mode, it makes browsing ultra smoother. This adds Princess animations to make it even more classy. You get a customizable interface with this. This is Volvo Beautifier. Get your hands on. Try it yourself. It is fun when you use it. It is just a three step process to fix this specified module could not be found in Windows 10. Go to search bar and type command prompt. Click here to open it. Then type this command carefully dash h dash r dash s g colon star dot star slash s slash d and hit enter. It will take some time so you have to do yourself then close this window again go to search bar and type command prompt click here to open it now type sfc slash scan now it will also take some time to complete its process after that close this window then go to search bar and type virus and threat protection Click here to open it, then click on advanced scan, select this option and click on scan now. This will also take some time to complete its process. After that close this window and go to search bar, then type file explorer options. Click here to open it. On this window select view tab, then check this option. Scroll down and uncheck this option. Click on S, then click on apply and then OK. Go to search bar and type task manager. Click here to open it. Then right click on application frame host and select end task. Ok, now close this window, go to search bar and type run, click here to open it, then type reg edit and click on ok. It will open registry editor, now expand hk local machine, then expand software folder, from here expand microsoft folder. Scroll down, and expand windows folder, ok, then expand current version, scroll down, right click on it, and then click on delete, select as, ok. Now expand HK current user, then expand software folder, then expand Microsoft folder, then expand Windows folder, expand current version, and from here, right click on run and select delete. Select S. Now expand HK local machine, then expand software folder, then go for Microsoft folder, scroll down and expand Windows folder, then expand current version and right click on run once and select delete, click on S. Again expand HK current user, expand software folder, expand Microsoft folder, then expand Windows folder, then expand current version, right click on run once 
and click on delete select as that's it guys close all windows and just restart your system your problem will be solved you're good to go